I'm at Lily's birthday party, and I just keep putting food into Susie's mouth, and he won't stop me. He doesn't even look what it is. He doesn't even look to see who's doing it. He just keeps eating it. Should I give him hummus? I think he's gonna like it. <laughs> hey girl, taking a shot without me? Is that what I saw? There's some left. <laughs> I just danced so hard that my boob literally came out of my bra, out of my shirt, and I grabbed it just in time. Tell him my boob was out. The boob came out, but she caught it. She caught it. Lily, did you see my boob? Did you see the boob? <laughs> oh, I saw the boob. <laughs> did that the skin on my face ripped it hurt I have two minutes to let this sit on my face so I figured why not say hello I also have a nice little timer up here going I am so bad at skincare it's something that I never cared about and now that I'm 25 I'm like wow I wish I would have cared about skincare a lot more when I was younger and I didn't so I would go to bed all the time with makeup on my face with not a second thought. It was just like that was the norm. I would never wash my makeup off. I don't know why. Thinking about doing that now, I can't even imagine like all that dirt and makeup on your face. But I had great skin. I never broke out. In fact, it kind of seems like now that I actually care about my skin, now I'm breaking out. Maybe it's true that all of the cleansing products and anti aging products and all the facials and shit actually ruin your skin so that you have to keep buying the products. Who knows? All I know is I never used to break out like this and now all of a sudden my chin is always a fucking playground for little jerks. But what are we doing today? I'm doing Celebs React at 2 which is full screens version of YouTubers React. I'm pretty sure it's still the Fine Bros though or an affiliation with them or something because I know that one of them, I forget which one, one of them is going to be there today and I wanted to go to therapy today. I need to go to therapy today. <laughs> Today, but I can't because uh, the only appointment was for three and I don't think that I could make it in time for that so that's a big bummer honestly I need more therapy I need to start going I was going every week for a while and then I stopped because I was feeling a lot better and now I'm crazy again so I need to start going again just seems like I can never get my schedule right Ugh. Ugh. and I'm gonna edit you it says to only keep this stuff on your face for two minutes, but I feel like it's not ready to be taken off yet. I guess I should take it off though. Don't mind the white. I'm baking my face right now. This just came out of my beauty blender. Ew. Look at the film on the top. That's all the oil from the makeup. It's that's what's that's what I'm putting on my pores every day. But my beauty blender came cleaner and softer and fluffier. You should have seen when I cleaned out my brushes the other day. I should have shown it because it was gross. It's crazy how much stuff gets stuck into your brushes. Because they're so small, but when you look at the shit that comes out of it, 
And I'm not gonna lie, I don't clean my brushes that often because I'm a normal human being and I don't see the need because I only put it on my own face. Maybe that's why I've been breaking out so much. Ew, look. Uh. I'll tell you what though, I always swear by this foundation and guess what? That shit is waterproof. <laughs> Side note, I am in desperate need of a new beauty blender. I've had this one for over a year and it's just another one of those things that I never think to go buy it. Like when I do my makeup in the morning, I'm like, oh, I really need a beauty blender. But then I never go to the store to buy one. I guess I could order one online, but I just never think about it. Like right now I'm not gonna do it because I'm getting ready and then I gotta go do this thing. I saw this hack so long ago on the internet so many times and I never tried it. And finally I tried it because I've been curling my hair a lot more often. And I'm just gonna show you how to do it. This is a like three minute hairdo. Watch this. Okay, first thing you do is just flip over and if you have long hair and you curl it I strongly urge you to do this because I wish I had been doing this for the past however many years of my life and I haven't so you just put your hair in a pony on the top of your head like such then you take your curling iron obviously ooh, come back. then you take your curling iron and you start curling the pieces up here by the way I'm really just taking advantage of long hair right now because I'm not gonna have long hair for much longer <laughs> I'm gonna miss hair, honestly. I've had long hair my whole life, and it's kind of like my comfort blanket, like my safety blanket, but it's time. I've had it for way too long. My hair's looked the same for way too long. My hair is dead, my hair is dry, my hair is split, it's crying, it's falling out because it's so dead on the ends. Every time I brush it, I get handfuls of hair. The hack said to do it in three sections. I'm gonna do it in a few more sections. Maybe if I had a bigger barrel, I could do it in three, but the size of this barrel and the texture and length of my hair, I feel like I need to do a few more sections, maybe like five or six. But if you were doing your whole head individually, it would be a lot more sections. So, well, you'll see. Ta-da! So now you have this curly pony, right? Right. So now we're just gonna take, well, I guess I'll spray the ends a little bit first. Just as a little, you know. Get a little hold in them. Mm -hmm. Now, if you don't like this look and you think it looks stupid, sorry for making you sit through this little tutorial. If you're just like running out real quick and you just want a really quick, easy, loose wave, let's all be honest with ourselves. This looks pretty dope. And obviously, I'm gonna go through and maybe curl like this piece again, just a little bit higher. There might be a little couple little touch-ups that I'll do, but as a whole, I would walk out of the door like this. I'm gonna go on camera, so I'm gonna fix it a little bit, but this is nice, try it. Earlier, I did Celebs React, which was so fun, by the way. It was so much fun. It was, it was a lot different than YouTubers React, actually. It was the same concept. It was just done really differently because I'm pretty sure it's a longer format. So I'm pretty sure they're like half hour or 45 minute episodes. I'm guessing, I haven't seen an episode of it, because I don't think there's any out yet, but I feel like it's probably like Girl Code or something on MTV where it's like longer segments talking about different things, and I reacted to a lot of things, but it was, it was really cool. But when I got home, I was just so tired. I have this disease where no matter what time of day it is, no matter what I did, when I get home, I'm tired. I, the weirdest thing, I just get so tired, so then I ate, and then I uh, watched How I Met Your Mother, obviously, because I'm so close to the end. And then I chugged two cups of coffee. And now I'm lightheaded from all the coffee. I'm gonna touch up my hair a little bit, touch up my makeup, and film some videos. I have a lot of videos that I'm really excited to film right now, but quite a few of them are makeup videos. So I'll probably end up filming the makeup one tomorrow because my makeup's already done. But yeah, that's, that's my day right now. And then I'll probably open this fan mail that's just been sitting over there. We'll see. Didn't, didn't do the fan mail. Uh, <laughs> oops. I messed up. I should have put Lily's party at the end of the last vlog, but for some, whatever. It's fine. Um, I'm gonna upload this now. Until then, guess who doesn't have a sign off? It's me, I still don't have a sign off.